The Ardeeds Arena in Sofia was the venue for the season-ending WTA Tournament of Champions, as eight of the world's top players did battle, all of them looking to end 2013 in fine style. First up on court was a player making her debut in this event, Hobart champion Elena Viznina. Her opponent in Group Chadets in recent years has been more accustomed to playing in the WTA Championships. But despite being in Bulgaria, Sam Stoza is finishing 2013 with a bang, having reached the final of her last two tournaments. In a fiercely contested opening set, both players contributed to some stunning rallies. The first seven games all went with serve. But in the eighth, it was the 2011 US Open champion who raised her game to secure the first break of the match. Turned out, one break was all Stoza needed, and she closed out the first set 6-3. However, in the second set, it was the Russian who started the better, and Vesnina raced into a three-love lead. Back came the Australian, though, as the 2013 Osaka and Carlsbad winner got back to level terms with some typically fearsome play. And it got even better for the fourth seed when she broke Vesnina again for a 4-3 lead. From there, the momentum was fully with the world number 19 she dictated every area of play. Stoza getting her 10th win in her last 11 matches with a 6-3, 6-3 victory in the group Shredette's clash. Two unbeaten players met in the next match, Strasbourg champion Elise Cornet took on five-time 2013 title winner Simona Halep. The top seed who started the better as Halep broke the French number one in her opening service game. But after falling 3-1 down, the world number 27 hit back to get back on level terms. Both players were now involved in a real battle with some scintillating tennis entertaining the fans as Cornet pulled out all the stops to stay with the Romanian. But despite some incredible play from the 23-year-old, it was Halep who won the vital seventh game. And in doing so, went on to take the first set 6-4. In the second, the momentum continued for the world number 14 and she opened up a 5-2 lead thanks to some relentless backcourt tennis. Sadly for Cornet, a valiant second set comeback fell just short as Halep got a sixth straight victory on the WTA, winning her second match in Group Sadika, 6-4, 6-4, much to the delight of the Romanian fans. In the final contest of the day, Maria Kirilenko's replacement, Elena Spitalina, was in action for the first time in this year's tournament. The Ukrainian knew she had to win to have any hope of making the semi-finals. Her opponent in the group Tredets class was Anastasia Pavlichenkova, who was looking to bounce back after losing to Halep on Tuesday. It was the Russian who looked in a determined mood early on, as she raced into a 5-2 lead. Known for her power on the WTA, Pavlichenkova demonstrated her delicate side as she went on to secure the opener 6-2. Vitalina showed more fighting spirit in the second set though, as the two exchanged breaks early on. Again though, it was the world number 26 who came up with the goods when it mattered most. Pavlichenkova grabbing a third straight break of serve in the fifth game. And it turned out to be the crucial break, as both players held serve from then on. The 22-year-old setting up a direct shootout on Friday with Elise Cornet for a semi-final spot. 
result also means Simona Halep is the first player to qualify for the last four.